final round of the Wells Fargo Championship from Quail Hollow Club in Charlotte, North Carolina, where Rory McIlroy fires a 61 on Saturday, up by four to start the final round. Who would be able to catch it? Webb Simpson in the final group, off the green at the second, and Simpson with a nice make. Plenty of fans rooting on the Charlotte resident. McElroy with a nod of the head, but still with the lead as he comes to seven, looking for eagle. Downhill putt doesn't quite get there. Those putts were all falling on Saturday. McElroy couldn't believe it, but he settles for bird. Phil Mickelson off the green at 13. And lefty tracking right to the cup. Nice shot to get back to 11 under par for Mickelson. Normally see him work with the wedge from off the green. Here's Patrick Rogers at the 10th. Downhill putt looking for eagle left to right. Great story developing for Rogers. In on an exemption, trying to earn his tour card. He would need a solo second. He was well on his way. Justin Thomas in the same pairing with Rogers, their roommates down in Jupiter, Florida. Just a Sunday game between the two. And Thomas on the flag here at 13. Nearly in for an ace, Thomas wanted it. Moving up the leaderboard on Saturday with the 65 and Thomas adding to it. Now Rogers, 14 under at the 11th. And eyeing this one just below the flag, carries over that ridge, sets up a nice birdie. Rogers would make that to get to 15 under par. Back to McElroy, 19 under now. 329 yard drive. An easy number to the pin, a couple of feet away, a kick in birdie for McElroy at the 12th, and he would get to 20 under. Back to Justin Thomas, nearly the ace at 13. Then he bogeys 14, so he comes right back at 15 and holds an eagle putt. That would move him to 11 under par into the top six on the leaderboard. McElroy. Shorter, par four, this at the 14th. Drove it the length of the hole and then a little pitch and a putt. And that is a birdie for McElroy to get to 21 under. Not done though. A 364 yard drive. Yes, McElroy, the beginning of the infamous Green Mile, making easy work of it. Just a wedge in from 145 and he knocks it to two feet. That takes him to 22 under. He would give a shot back at 17, but here at 18, one more putt, a par for McElroy to clinch it, a seven shot victory, a new tournament record, and win number 11 for McElroy on tour. We move from Charlotte to Colonial, opening round coverage Thursday, 1 p.m. Eastern on Sirius XM PGA Tour Radio, Golf Channel at 4 p.m.